Hi there, my name is Greg Olson and I'm the director of the New York State Office for Aging. In the time that it takes to record this message, three people will be hospitalized and one person will die. What exactly am I talking about? I'm talking about sepsis. Maybe you were like me, you heard the word but you weren't quite sure what it was. Sepsis is the body's overwhelming and life-threatening response to infection. It can lead to tissue damage, organ failure, and death. You may have heard of septic shock. That is when sepsis is most severe and most life-threatening. More than 1.7 million people in the U.S. are diagnosed with sepsis each year. One every 20 seconds, and in every 90 seconds somebody will die. And this is an equal opportunity killer, affecting people of all ages. Most sepsis cases, 80%, originate in the community, not in a facility. Some individuals are more susceptible. In fact, 70% of adult sepsis patients are 60 years of age or older. Adults age 65 and older are 13 times more likely to be hospitalized with sepsis than people who are younger. These statistics are absolutely startling. But remember, this is a condition that is preventable, and you can prevent it by knowing the signs and symptoms. A high temperature, the presence of an infection, even a small cut can cause an infection, feeling of confusion, and severe pain, discomfort, or shortness of breath. If you have a combination of any of these symptoms, you may have sepsis. Seek a medical professional immediately, call 911, go to the hospital and say, I am concerned that I might have sepsis. It could save your life.